Hey everybody, it's Jang here from UltimateRC.com and RCMania.com, the place for toy grade RC reviews. This is my look at the Fastlane RC JLX Microdrive. This is a tiny little car, it fits in the palm of an adult's hand, and it's got this really unique uh, styling to it with these really large balloon-like uh, tires that are really bright green, and they're actually pneumatic, they're actually partially air-filled, and they're very squishy, very very soft so that should give you a lot of really good traction. The really interesting thing about this design here is that the tires are larger than the body of the car itself. So it's going to allow it to actually drive upside down if it flips. As you saw for a second there it actually has tank steering so one motor drives one side and the other motor drives the other side. Here is the controller for it. If you thought the car was small, the controller is even smaller still and it's very simple. You've got buttons for each wheel. so. The buttons on the left side control the left side wheels and the buttons on the right side control the right side wheels together. You push both of them forward to go forward, push both of them back to go backward, or you operate them independently or in opposite directions if you want to turn. When it comes down to it, the driving experience with the JLX Microdrive is just bundles and bundles of fun. On a smooth high traction surface like this on-road RC racing course that I'm on here, it has so much traction that when you go in turns it'll actually lean up on two wheels and sometimes it'll actually flip over or what's called traction rolling. If you change direction too suddenly, forward to back, back to front, sometimes it'll just flip over end to end. But no matter what you do, it just keeps on going. Pretty much nothing gets this thing to really stop. Even if you run into something hard that's just not going to move and not going to allow you to even drive over it, it's just going to flip over and you'll at the very least be able to reverse direction or just spin around and keep going. Because it doesn't get stuck easily and because pushing any button on the controller makes something happen, I think that this is a really good car for younger kids who don't quite have their hand-eye coordination developed yet. As long as they know that they can push two buttons at the same time to do something different, they'll eventually figure out the whole thing. Now check this out. This is some terrain that has stumped some larger vehicles that I've tested. No sweat for the JLX Microdrive. Those big tires with their large amount of traction and the pretty decent ground clearance underneath them in between just lets this drive right over small rocks and even larger gravel like this. It does not get stuck very easily. However, I do want to note that when it's upside down like this with the silver side down or the black side up, it has a little bit less ground clearance. So you're a little bit more likely to get stuck if ever, if it's upside down like this. Those tires tend to bounce around so much though that even if you start to get stuck on something, you can probably just start pushing buttons and it will just kind of get itself out. The motors have quite a lot of torque, which is really surprising for how small the vehicle is and the fact that it just uses AAA batteries. Here you're seeing it drive on some really soft, powdery, dry dirt. And again, the strong motors and large tires allow it to just power over everything. Obviously, I like this thing a lot. I had a really good time with it, and I think it's great for kids of many ages. So that about does it for this review. Thank you very much for watching, and for more details and more RC reviews, be sure to check out rcmania.com. See you there.